Hello, hello. Good evening. Hi, good evening. Hello, hello. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. Hello, hello. Can you hear me? ¿Te escucha? Sí. Yes, everybody can hear. How are you? How are you tonight? Hungry? Tired. You're tired. Oh, I imagine it's exhausted, right? After a long day. <laughs> Jancy, how are you? Jancy, can you hear? Renee? Hola, buenas noches. Hey, how are you? Good evening. How are you today? Thank you. You're good? Right. Rene, how are you tonight? Rene, can you hear me? Hello. Jessica, Vanessa, how are you tonight? I'm tired. You're tired. <laughs> you work out for the, the university. What? Uh-huh. Working. You were working. What about Lucy? Lucy Reyes. How are you? I'm fine. You're fine, yes? Okay, that's very good. Marvin. Hello. Hello, fine, how are you tonight? You're fine? Very good. Very good, excellent. You ready to continue? We got Jensi, we come, yeah. Jessica, Veronica, yeah. Carlos, yeah. Loida. We come. Sí. Yes, okay. We're ready to continue. Remember that yesterday we were studying about the verb to be. And we also saw about the possessive adjectives. Yes. Do you have any questions? Preguntas? Preguntas acerca de los temas de ayer? Si me ayudan con el micrófono, creo que se escucha la, se escucha la tele, creo. Thank you, thank you. Okay. Any question, guys? Buenas noches, teacher. Hello, good evening. How are you? Hey. Este, fíjese. Hello. Hello. Dígame. El... Hello. Hello. Hola, buenas noches. Hello, hello. Buenas noches. Solo comentarle que me voy a conectar solo dos veces. Sería en una ah. PC con mi teléfono. Solo okay, para... perfecto. Ok. Ok, no hay problema. Ok, gracias. Okay. Thank you. Hello. Hello, hello. Eh, Good evening, welcome. Eh, no escuchaba nada, por eso no podía contestar. Ah, ok. Eh, 
Are no you? problem. That's okay. <laughs> okay, <laughs> perfect. That's yes, very good. Thank you. you are here. Thank you very much. Hola, buenas noches. Juan, no podía contestar, no escuchaba. Okay, no problem. Now you are here. That's the important thing. Okay. Great, thank you. Okay. I was saying that, remember that yesterday we were uh, talking about and studying with the verb to be and also the possessive adjectives. Do you have any question? ¿Alguna pregunta de los temas de ayer? No. No. No questions. No. 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 Okay, no. let's check then. Let's remember about the alphabet. Yes, remember yesterday we saw a little bit uh, of practice of this. So now you're going to tell me the alphabets to remember about. Now, let's see. Miguel, can you tell me the alphabet, please? The alphabet? Yes, please. A, B, C, D, B, uh -huh. F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, O, P, Q, R, S, C, U, B, W, X, Y, Z. All right, very good. Thank you. Let's see, Brenda. Continue, please. Tell me the alphabet. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, A, K, H, H, I, H, I, J, J, K, good. L, 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 L. good. Mm -hmm. No, no veo. <laughs> no. M, M. Puede no ser la pantalla. N, ajá. O. O, P, Q, R. 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 S. S. T, J. B, D, J. W. W. X. Sí. No los alcanzo a ver las otras. Y. Y. Y and Z. Z. And Z. Very good. Thank you. Okay, now let's see. Noida, tell me the alphabet, please. Hi, buenas noches. Hey, good evening. Welcome to the class. Okay. Tell me the alphabet, A. please. Uh -huh. B, C. D A E E F F G H I N I J Q J K A L L M N O P Q R S T U B W X Y C. Z. Very good job. That's nice. Okay. Gracias. Now we have this review. Let's continue then okay, with more of the alphabets. We're going to listen to some part here. And you tell me if you can listen to it. Vamos a probar la hora. Esperamos que ahora sí se pueda escuchar. Let's check the platform. the next one. Have you were there in the platform? Ya empezaron a hacer los ejercicios? Okay. Yes. Yes, okay, good. ¿Cómo les fue? Yes. How was it? Was it good? Good practice? 
Right. Now let's say if you can listen to this one. ¿Se escucha? No se escucha no. nada. Not at all. Okay. Not at all? Okay. So we have problems here. Now we are going to check the next audio. Is this one? We're going to have some spelling. You tell me about this one. Let me check. Y ahora esta se escucha. No, teacher. Nada, nada. No. 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 Okay, maybe somebody can share it. Si, si alguien lo puede compartir así como hicieron ayer, se les escuchaba. Very good job. Very good job. Reactions for my Hello. Reactions. And the next one, group number three. Edwin, Jose, Luz, Edwin. Edwin. Let's check the next one then. Okay, so we have some spellings here. What we're going to do, we're going to spell our names. As you have here in the audio, it says, what's your name? And you spell those. You spell the name. For example, here, you spell the name of Sarah. Okay, thank you. Police officer takes care of people. Takes care of people. Okay. Very good. Let's see here. What's your name? We're going to repeat this one. What's so your see. name? Excellent. I'm Sarah Connor. Is it? I'm Sarah Connor. Yeah, good. Okay. Then it says, is that S A R A H? Uh -huh. So that would be Sarah. You see that you have it here? Sarah. All right. Sarah. And it says, yes, that's right. That's right. That's right. It's like, that's correct. How did you spell you? Uh -huh. How do you spell your last name? How do you spell this? your last name? Excellent. Your last name. C-O-N-N-O-R. Correct. Okay, so we're going to check it here. No. That we have it in the platform. Solo se puede ir viendo, pero no creo que no se va a poder escuchar. A doctor. So let's see. So we see in the example. Ah, perdón. No, a police officer. What is the next one? So you have the police officer, the doctor, Teacher, casi en casa escucha como que si alguien tiene el audio encendido como en otra clase. Yes. Si alguien me ayuda, por favor, con el audio que se está escuchando ahorita. Ok, thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, so we are going to practice this. Let's spell it. Vamos a practicar este deletreo. You're going to spell your names. Uh, let's see, Marvin. Marvin, spell your name, please. How do you spell it? How do you spell Marvin? Perdón, perdón. How do you spell your name? Mm. No, no logro escuchar muy bien. Es que me está fallando mis audífonos. Ah, ok. ¿Qué es tu nombre? Ajá. Spell your ¿Cómo? name. Spell your name. 
que deletré mi nombre. Uh -huh. Yes. Ok. Ah. Okay. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. R B I N. And that's correct. Okay, now let's see. Catherine. Catherine, how do you spell Rebecca? Sí. Uh -huh. Hello. Hola. Yeah. Este. Okay. Rebecca. A. Rebecca. Ah, Rebecca. Ah, yes. Yes. Okay. R. E. B. E. C. A. That's correct. Thank you. Okay. Let's continue with Loida. Loida, how do you spell your last name? L. O. I. Your last name. Last name. Not ah, your name, but your last name. Rodriguez. Rodriguez. Mm -hmm. R-O. R está, cor está incorrecto. It's R. R. R-O-D. R-I. R-I. I. Okay. G D U N C Z. That's correct. Good one. Okay, we have the spelling there. Now we are going to continue. So this, uh, you can listen on the platform. En la plataforma, ustedes sí lo van a poder escuchar, pero no es por acá porque este no se, no se puede transmitir así con audio, porque sí se ve acá que va corriendo, pero no sé por qué el audio. So, let's check here. Now, about the next part is to remember about the present simple of the verb to be. So, it's to remember about it. Yesterday, remember that we saw I am, you are. So, just to remind you about it. The verb to be, you have affirmative case. For example, I am at home, right? So we say, I am at home. Then you are at home. He is at home. He is at home. It is at home. Now, remember here, at home is the complement, right? What is the subject? You have the subject, all this line. And remember that we conjugate the verb to be depending on the subjects that you have. So if we give an, an example, for example, if I say, I am in a restaurant. What about you, Joaquin? Give me an example. Say, I am and mention a place. Hello, teacher. Hello, good evening. Give us an example, please. Say, I eh, am. Podría repetirme. Sure. Un ejemplo acá de forma afirmativa. I am. To be. Ajá. Y mencionamos un lugar. I am in the restaurant. I am at the beach. I am uh, in my work, in my house. I am in the park. Excellent. Thank you. I am in the park. Very good. Okay. Angelica. Give us an example of you are. Um, you are um, on beach. You are at the beach. Very good. Imagine that you are at San Diego Beach or Mahawal, right? Also, it can be. <laughs> okay, let's see about he. Then we have he is at home. This is affirmative case. Now, this is negative. That is, estoy o no estoy, right? So, está o no está. So, let's say, I am not at home. You are not at home. He is not at home. She is not at home. It is not at home. So, give us a compliment. Luis, can you give us an example, please? With negative. I am not a student. I am not a student. Okay, very good job. Nice. Now let's see Lucy. Lucy Reyes. Lucy Kings. Give us an example, please. 
Lucy? Lucy, can you hear? ¿Se puede oír? All right. Oscar, please. Oscar, give us an example, please. With negative. Hello. Hola, se escucha. Hola, mi señal está fallando. De repente se escucha cortado. Oh, no este, okay. lo que habla. Okay. ¿Y ahora se escucha? Este creo que es la señal porque se me traba la pantalla. Okay. Sí, está fallando el server del Wi-Fi. O en general, creo que he estado fallando bastante estos días también. Okay, then Catherine. Catherine, can you give us an example, please? Use negative. Of he is not. He is not uh, my my son. Ah, very good. He is not my son. Very good. Nice. Okay. Now let's see. With the rest of the subjects, that is, we are at home. You remember what is we? What subject is we? Nosotros. So, excellent. That's perfect. So we say we are at home. You are at home, or they are at home. Let's see. Give me an example of this one, Brenda. Hi, Brenda. Mm. Hello. Give us an example with we. We are. We are uh -huh. at home mm -hmm. doctor. Ah, we are at the doctor's home. Okay, that's all right. You're using a possessive. That's nice. Good. Jessica Franco. An example now with they are. Hello? Hi, Jessica. They are in the work. They are in the world. Perfect. That's good. Okay, let's see. Jessica Rivas. Now give us an example with negative form of we are not. Jessica? Jessica Rivas? Hello. <laughs> Se escucha. Yes, you can hear it. Okay. You have an example? Siento, no podía hacer está bastante lento. Oh, okay. Está lloviendo. Ah, ah, sí, se escucha un poco cortado. Eh, ok. We are at home. We are not. Home. Ok, we are not at home. Good, we have this one. Now, we, we have are... this part. We are not at home. We are not at the park. Okay. We are not. Uh, the beach. Ah, excellent. We are not at the beach. We are not in Los Cebollines. We are not. We are uh, not. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, where, where the pizza. Uh, we are not at Pizza Hut, at Papa John's. Yeah, that's very good. Okay. Now we have more examples here with the verb to be affirmative. Say, I am. A student. Miguel Antonio, repeat it please. I am a student. I am a student. 
Excellent. Thank you. Angelica Rodriguez. Repeat. He is a nurse. He is a nurse. Excellent. That's good. Mira. Kevin. Kevin? Repeat it, please. She is a nurse. She is a nurse. That's all right. Good one. Joaquin, it is a nurse. He is a nurse. A nurse. A nurse. A nurse. That's correct. Good one. Okay, let's check here. Luis. Luis Barona. Let's repeat it. You are good friends. You are good friends. 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 That's right. Thank you. Oscar. Let's repeat it. We are good friends. Oscar? Oscar? Te escucha. Sandra. Sandra Barrera. Repeat it. They are good friends. They are good friends. That's correct. Good one. Okay, so you see here, this is a form of the verb to be, but this is affirmative manner. Now, we also have questions. Of course, we can formulate interrogatives. Now, when you have the interrogative manner, you need to change the position of the verb to be in the subject. Cuando hay una pregunta, entonces se debe de cambiar de posición, tanto el verbo como el sujeto. Yeah, so you have verb to be plus subject plus a complement. Now, let's repeat it. Am I crazy? Brenda, repeat. Am I crazy? Am I crazy? Thank you, that's good. Jessica Rivas, repeat it. Are you a student? Jessica, can you hear? Jessica Rivas. No? Miguel, Miguel Abrego. Mm. Miguel, hi. Let's Are repeat you... it. Are you a student? Are you a student? Very good job. Right. Marvin, Marvin Garcia. Repeat it. Is he Alex? Is he Alex? Excellent. Very good. Jancy Ramos. Repeat. Is she shy? Is she shy? Is she shy? Good one. What is shy, guys? What is shy? Timido. Excellent. Thank you. So you can say timid or you can say shy. Very good. Nice. Se puede ver bien la presentación, ¿verdad? Sí. Yes, you can. Okay. Sí. Good. Now, let's continue with the next. Let's see Catherine Rebecca. Let's repeat. Is it a cat? Catherine? Hola. Oh, yeah. Hello, Catherine. Is, is it a cat? Excellent. Is it a cat? Very good job. Nice one. Okay, let's see. Uh, Loida. Are we friends? Are we friends? That's all right. Good one. Let's see. Another classmate by here. Gen C. Gen C. Alexandra. Let's repeat. Are you happy? Are you happy? Are you happy? Very good job. That's nice. Okay, let's continue. Veronica, let's repeat it. Are they lazy? Are they lazy? Very good. What is lazy? Perezosa. Excellent. That's good. Okay. Now, Let's observe that here, as you formulate a question, it's necessary to change the position. We have the verb to be in the subject, and then you have a complement. Now, do you have any question of this? Alguna pregunta? 
Ya vamos a hacer práctica. We're going to make a practice of this. We formulate questions. No questions? Preguntas? No? No. Okay, let's see another, like a short conversation. Tenemos acá como una conversación corta. Very short conversation. For example, it starts the man and it says, Are you married? Carlos, repeat please. Are you married? Are you married? Married? married. Very married. good. Very good. Renee, repeat. Are you married? El micrófono, lo tienes desactivado, René. Are Thank you me. married? Very good job, that's nice. Uh, Jessica, Jessica Franco, repeat. Are you married? Are you married? Very good. Jessica Esmeralda, repeat. Are you married? Jessica? Jessica Esmeralda? ¿Se escucha? No. Ok, Brenda. Brenda, repeat it. Are you married? Are you married? Very good. That's nice. Ok, now let's answer. When you have the answer, que es la respuesta, podemos tener una respuesta corta. Respondiendo así. Yes, I am. Ya que la, la pregunta es directa porque es you. Entonces el sujeto me debe de cambiar. Yes, I am. So let's repeat. Yes, I am. Joaquín, repeat. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. I am. I am. Uh, I am. Yes, I am. Very good job. Miguel, repeat. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Excellent job. Sandra, now let's practice the question. Practiquemos esta pregunta. Sandra, uh, Sandra Marisol, are you married? Yes or no? Are you married? Aha, and the answer, respuesta, en su caso, su información, is affirmative or negative? Yes, I am not. Yes, yes, I am. Si mm. es afirmativo, entonces, yes, yes, I am. Y si fuera negativo, entonces sería, no, I'm not. Yes. Uh -huh. Verónica, are you married, Verónica? Are you married? Uh -huh. Okay. Answer. Carlos, answer. Respuesta is yes, I am or no, I'm not. Yes, I am. Very good job. That's nice. Okay. Now let's see. Marvin, Marvin, are you married? Yes, I am. Very good job. That's nice. Okay, now let's formulate this question. Where are you from? Where are you from investigates about the nationality? So, esta es una WH question en la que investigamos algo ya específico. Ya no requiere de afirmativo o negativo. So, let's say, where are you from? And here it says, I'm from Argentina. In my case, I am from El Salvador. Now, tell me about you, Kevin. Where are you from? Kevin Orlando? I am from El Salvador. El Salvador, very good, nice. All right, let's see, we have another classmate here. Jensi, Jensi Alexandra, where are you from? Where are you from? I am from? I am from El Salvador. El Salvador, very good. Rene, Rene Cruz, where are you from? Right. So that's the form of this. I am from El Salvador. El Salvador, that's good. I am from El Salvador, very good. Many people from El Salvador, right? Salvadorian. Right. Salvadorian. Yeah, we are Salvadorian people. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. Let's continue with the next question. That's how old are you? Sandra Marisol, repeat. How old are you? Repeat. How old are you? Excellent. Jessica Sarai, how old are you? Repeat. How old are you? 
How old are you? How old are you? Very good job. Nice. Uh, Rene, repeat. How old are you? How old, how old are you? How old are you? All right. Very good. Look at that here. Investigates about your age. Investiga su edad. ¿Qué edad tiene? I yes. am 29. All right. Look at that here. It's saying I am 29. Good. And if you want to be more formal, si uno quiere ser más formal, se puede incluir como years old. I am 29 years old. I am 15 years old. So you can include that. But look at that here. We have a number. Now, let's see. And then it has the name, right? That is very important here. It says, what's your name? Let's see. Brenda, repeat. What's your name? What's your name? Excellent. Jessica. Uh, let me see. Let me tell you the, the last name. Just, uh, Jessica Hernandez. Repeat. What's your name? What's your name? Very good job. That's nice. Okay. And now here you have Betty. Now Betty. that's good. So we are going to repeat with your name. My, All right. My name is Jessica. Excellent job. Very good. Okay. Now let's see. Joaquin, you repeat the question and Carlos, you are going to answer with your name. All right. Joaquin, tú vas a formular la pregunta. Y Carlos va a responder. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Eh, yes. Te, te sería desde el principio. Sería desde el eh, principio. No, only this one. Vamos a ir paso ah. a paso con este y después hacemos eh, la conversación completa. Okay. Ah, eh, ya. Yes. What, what's, what's your name? Very what's good. Your name? Very good. Names. Names. Se puede mm. decir solo, por ejemplo, donde dice what's your name, este, solo decir el nombre, porque también se puede yes. poner a name is. Exactly. ¿verdad? Exactly. Ajá. Cuando queremos ser como, digamos, como uh, más centrados al, al punto, ¿verdad? Dando nada más la, la respuesta específica, es nada más el nombre. Pero si queremos sonar como más, un poco más formales, más puede amplio. incluir más amplio, sonar más formal, entonces se incluye. Yeah. My name is, right? Suena como más formal. Sí. Por ejemplo, en una entrevista de trabajo, por ejemplo, right? Es como más formal, más cortés, utilizar la manera con, o completa. Sí, claro. Yes. Ok. Carlos, so answer. What's your name? My name is Carlos. That's all right. Thank you. Jensi, now you repeat the question. What's your name? And Veronica, you're going to answer. Y Veronica, respond. Yes, Jensi, are you ready? Yes, okay, let's start. What's your name? Thank you. Veronica? Veronica, can you hear? ¿Se escucha? No se escucha, ¿cómo dijo? Jensi, can you repeat, please? Jensi le va a hacer la pregunta y usted la va a responder. Ah, oh, bueno. Can you please repeat, Jensi? What's your name? Thank you. Veronica? My name. My name is Veronica. Good, my name, name. Good. My name. Excellent. That's good. Cuando pronunciamos la M, tenemos que en cerrar bien los labios como toparlos. Para My que name. se produzca, ajá, para que se produzca bien el sonido. Entonces, My mm, name. Name. Mm, name. Ajá, name. good. Yes. No me van a decir mamé, ¿ok? <laughs> <laughs> Suena similar, right? But... <laughs> Sounds very similar, very, very similar. <laughs> okay, <laughs> now let's do the, the complete conversation, right? Ahora vamos a hacer la conversación completa. Let's see. 
Carlos, you're going to start. Carlos, iniciamos. Y va a responder Jessica Esmeralda. Yes. Okay. You ready? Yes. All right. Are you married? Are you married? Married? Are you married? Good. Jessica? Yes, I am. Excellent. Continue. Where are you from? Excellent. I'm from El Salvador. Very good job. That's nice. Continue, Carlos. How old are you? Excellent. I am uh, 24. 24. Very good job. That's nice. Carlos? What's your name? Great. My name is Jessica Escobar. Very good job. Nice, nice. That's good. Okay. Now let's see. Renee. Renee. Renee and Sandra Marisol. Sandra, you formulate the questions. And Renee is going to respond. Yes. Okay. Are you ready? Yes. Yes. Ready. Okay. Ready. Let's start. Excellent. Are you married? Married? Married. That's cool. Are you married? Yes, I am. Excellent. That's good. Where are you from? I am from Salvador. Great. How old are you? I am... I am 40 years old. 30? 30 or 40? 30 or 40? 40, 40, 40, 40 years old. Very good job. 40 That's years nice. Old. That's good. Okay. What's your name? Renee. What's your name? Renee. Uh -huh. That's very good. Nice. Okay. Let's continue. Veronica with Jessica Sarai. Good morning, Cindy. Veronica, How you formulate you? the questions. Good and good Jessica morning, with the How answer. Fine. I have many things. Si, me con el but the is very Se como que está en clase. Yes. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. Veronica. The question, please. Are you? Uh -huh. Are you married? Not a not. Yes, I am, right? If it's affirmative, si fuera afirmativa. Not a not. Uh -huh. Okay, if it's negative, say no, I'm not. Good. No, no, I'm not. I'm not. Very good, okay? Now the next question, where? Where Where are you from? Good. You can invent a country, invent a país. I am from Russia, I am from Canada, I am from Mexico, the United States. Invent, invent a country. I am from Mexico. I am from Mexico, you're Mexico. Very good job. Okay, the next one, what's the next question? How old are you? Excellent. I am 33 years old. 33 years old, excellent. Mm -hmm. The last question. What's the next question? What's? What's your name? What's your name? Good. My name is Jessica Franco. Very good job. Thank you. Excellent, okay? We continue practicing then. Now, let's see. Let's stop for a while, for a moment. And we're going to pass the list. Let's see the ones that are present. Okay, let's check about the attendance, guys, for today. Let's see, Alicia Maribel is present. Alicia? No? No está presente, Alicia? No? 
Okay, let's continue. Angelica Maria. Aquí. Yes, right? Yes, present. Excellent. Brenda, Marcela. Presente. Thank you. Okay, let's continue with Carlos Arturo. Present. You present. Excellent. Thank you. Jessica Franco. Yes, I remember. I saw Jessica. Yes, present. Yes, yeah, present. Excellent. Thank you. Joaquin Jesus. Present. Thank you. Let's continue with Juan. Juan Antonio. Juan Antonio? Is present? No? Okay, let's continue. Catherine, Catherine Rebecca. Present. Present, thank you. Kevin Orlando. Present. Thank you. Loida Citali. Present. Great, thanks. Luis Antonio Barahona. Present. Thank you. Luz Margel. Present. Thank you. Maria Inés. No. Marvin Manuel. Present. Thank you. Miguel Antonio. Present. Thank you. Oscar Esaú. Oscar Esaú. No present. Reina. Reina Isabel. Reina. No. René Alonso. Alonso. Present. Igual present. que ayer. Yes, like yesterday. Very good. Sandra Marisol. Present. Present. Very good. Veronica Maricela. Present. Thank you. Jancy Yamilet. Present. Thank you. Jensi Alexandra. Present. Great, thanks. Jessica Esmeralda. Presente. Thank you. And Jessica Vanessa. Is Jessica Vanessa? Je uh, Jessica Rivas? Is not here? Ah, creo que tenía problemas con audio. Okay, we are going to check. We're going to check that. Thank you guys very much. Now let's continue. We continue with our session, with our class. Okay, so we have here the bird to be. Yes, here we have. Any question, guys? With the bird to be? Alguna pregunta? No questions? No? Okay, let's remember here that this one is affirmative, but in the negative, you can also respond like, for example, if they ask you, are you married? And this is negative, then you say, no, I'm not. You say, no, I'm not. Or no, I'm not married. You can say the compliment too. Let's see. Now let's ask another question. Let's see if I ask René. René, are you a doctor? You say, yes, I am or no, I'm not. It depends on your information. I am or not. No, I am not. No, no I am not. Not. That's good. Very good. Carlos. No, not, I am not. Aha. Uh -huh. Or you can say, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. ¿Qué suena más fluido? No, I'm not. Good. Okay. Carlos, are you a lawyer? What no, is a lawyer? I'm not. Very good. A lawyer. Abogado. Is? Excellent. Thank you. So, no, I'm not. Okay. Now, Carlos, you're going to formulate the question to, to Joaquín. To Joaquín. To Joaquín. Are you a police officer? Good. Te escucha como interferencia. Ok. 
ya, ahorita ya. Are you a police officer? Joaquín? Perdón. Can you repeat, Carlos, please? Are you a police officer? Ajá, escucho como cortado. ¿No se escucha bien? Okay, Carlos, then yeah, can you ask? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you can, you can. Okay. Are you a police officer? Uh, I'm not. I, uh, I'm not. No, I'm not. No. Not, I, I'm not. I'm not. Aha, uh -huh, that's good. Okay, now let's see. Loida. Loida? No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Good. Okay. Now, Loida, you formulate the question to Gen C. Okay. Are you, you can ask, are you a teacher? Are you a receptionist? Are you a nurse? Are you president? Are you? President. Ah, okay. Are you the president? No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Very good. That's nice. Right. Okay. We have some questions there. Now I have an exercise here for you. This exercise is to complete it. And with questions, verb to be. It says, choose the correct option to complete the sentence. So we select the best option that we have. And we have here a question. ¿Te puede ver bien? La diapositiva. ¿Sí? Yes. Okay, that's good. Yes, yes. Thank you. Look at that here as this one is a question. At the beginning, you need the verb to be because it's a yes, no question. Cuando investigamos una yes, no question es porque eh, queremos saber si sí o no. Entonces, al inicio va a ir verb to be. So, what is the best option here? The, the book, the notebook, blue. What option do you use? Am or is? Is. Is. Perfect. Perfect. Is one. And also because am is, is only for am. Ajá. And am, esa conjugación solo es para el sujeto de I, para yo. And it is third person, para tercera persona. En ese caso sería como it, de, para alguien, right? This is the notebook it's blue. Good. That's good. Okay, now see, let's check the next one. Brenda, give us the answer, please. Is, is she a singer? She a, sing, a singer? Uh -huh, that's good. Is she a singer? Very good. Okay, now let's see the next part. Sandra Marisol, give us the answer about the ruler. Are, are she... The ruler, the ruler. De la regla. Are. Look. Are, are. Or is. Are. Is. 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 Aha. That's good. Remember that are is only for the subject you, they, or we. But in this case, it's only one. When it's singular and it's a third person, it's tercera persona. Y es para algo, utilizamos it. Wow. Yes. So in this case, the correct form is is the ruler yellow. It's is, the ruler? It's, ah. uh -huh. is the ruler yellow? Yellow. Yes. Is, okay. Is she? In the case, okay, this one is, is she a singer, right? We got the answer. What about the next one? He's a farmer. R. Is or R? Is he, is, he, is he a farmer? Is, is he? Is, Aha, is that's he. good. Because it's only one subject. So it's un sujeto. It's tercera persona singular. So is he, is he a farmer? A farmer? Good. Farmer. Veronica, let's see this one. Um, I'm they, no, are they? Good. Are they? Are they? P? P? I'm blue. In blue. Excellent. That's good. Look at that here. We use are, right? And you use they. Um, uh -huh. We don't use am, right? Because am is only with I. Only with the subject I. Now, eh, uh, si observamos acá, utiliza they y no it, porque es plural. It 
solo lo utilizamos para una cosa o un animal, pero si es singular. Ahora, si es plural, nos referimos a, a para ah. todo, todo sujeto, ¿verdad? No es exclusivo para personas, es el day. Es en general. Animales, costas, personas, en general. Pero cuando es plural. Now, the next one. I, a um, teacher. Uh -huh. What's the um, correct form? Um, yes. Ah, that's good. Because the subject is I. Am I a teacher? Right? En esta ocasión es como cuando nos podemos hacer una pregunta a nosotros mismos. O también le puedo hacer la pregunta a alguien más, ¿verdad? Am I? Am I a teacher? O cuando preguntamos a alguien, ¿soy tu mejor amigo? Am I your best friend? Ay, no me queda la duda, right? <laughs> Am uh -huh. I your best friend? Right? So you answer like this, like, Am I a teacher? Teacher. Uh -huh, good. What about the next one? Let's see. Is. Uh, yes. Yes. Uh -huh. Is. Yes. Okay. Because is singular, yes, right? Uh, is the eraser white? Uh, is the eraser white? Is. Yes. Is, the is. Correct. Excellent. Now eraser, right? It's singular form. I don't know. Quiero ver. Ah, are okay. We, Excellent. Are we the right? Uh -huh. And writer. That's good. Are we yeah. waiter and writer? Waiter is mesero. And writer? Es... Escritor o escritora, right? It can be for a man or it can be for a um, for a woman. So uh, are we waiter and writer? And the next one, we have glue. It's he. It's, he. it's the glue. It's the glue. Is huh? she. Is it's she the glue uh, around her? Ajá, uh -huh. solo que acá ya no va a llevar he or she. Porque, uh, is, is, va a ser is. is. Aquí ya no necesitamos en ninguno de estos um, utilizar un pronombre como he, she, it, porque ya va el nombre específico del sujeto. Entonces, ahí es solo is, the glue, the Perfect, that's correct. Ajá. Is the glue correct? Uh -huh. Porque ya está el sujeto, el nombre del sujeto acá es the glue. Is the glue uh, all right? Yes, uh -huh. yes. Excellent. That's correct. Now, what about the next one? Are, uh, um, are you a uh, fireman? Are you a fireman? Yes, that's correct. Yes, cannot be I'm you, right? No, it's one like, are you a fireman? A fireman. A fireman. That's correct. Fireman. Are you? So those are questions. Questions that we have and with an exercise. Questions? Preguntas acerca de este ejercicio? No questions? No. No questions, questions? Okay. Now, as a homework, you need to go to the platform. Sí, como sí, tarea. Sí, Ajá, pues. como tarea. Necesito que vayan a la plataforma y en un chancecito ahí que tengan, pueden ver el video para reforzar lo que vimos ahora. Y no sé si vieron el, 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 el video tuvieron la oportunidad de verlo, el, el link que les envié, que aparece um, sí. un video. Sí, sí, sí. Yes, ¿Lo pudieron ver? Sí. ¿Sí? Ok. Sí. Se observaron ahí, vieron el uso del verb to be y también la forma de possessive adjectives. En una conversación bien común, una conversación bien corta también. Ok, guys. So we are going to continue and tomorrow tomorrow night thank you very much muchas gracias thank you very much thank you so much for attending me encantó thank you 
Thank you for your participation. Muchas gracias por su participación. Veo que a todos les encanta participar. A veces hemos tenido ahí quizás dificultad por el audio, eh, por la lluvia. En algunos lugares como que ha estado lloviendo, ¿verdad? Hello. ¿Se escucha? Sí. Sí, sí estamos bien? escuchando, sí. Ah, ok, perfecto. Ok, sí. Entonces, Solo una, una pregunta. Eh, sí. ¿Siempre va a ser una hora o se va a extender a dos? No, eh, siempre solo una. Fíjese que según el programa siempre es una hora. Ajá. Uh -huh. Siempre es una hora. De lunes ah, okay. a viernes. Bye, está bien. Exacto. Bye, muchas gracias. Les agradezco mucho. Pasen buenas noches. Buenas noches. Sorry. Okay. Thank you. Have a good night. Good night. Thank you. Good night. Thank you. Good night. Have a beautiful night. night. And see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Goodbye. 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 See you tomorrow. Goodbye. See you tomorrow. Goodbye. Have a good night. Take care.